Welcome back to some more Daisy, guys. Uh, I have no clue where the hell I'm at. But, uh, don't really want to go in that town there. Oh, there's a fire. I mean, there's a, uh, grocery store. Uh, I don't know about this. I don't know where this is. So, uh,. One thing we're going to do first is we're going to take off that bayonet. It's useless. But, uh, doesn't look like there's anyone down there at the moment. You just really got to be patient in this game. So right now, I could be shot at any time. I don't know if those doors are always open. But there's two doors right there and there that are open, so that may be a problem. Yeah, that door's open too, is it? It's a window, never mind. There's quite a few people on the server. It's only like what? Like nine, ten, but still, then be cautious as hell. Loving the look of this Mosin, but I cannot wait to uh, make it camouflaged. That's a good sign. There's a zombie there. Oh, hey, buddy. Oh, Jesus. Don't lag on me now. Take a, let's take a seat here. You can take a seat too. Thank you. But I pretty much pimped out this, this handgun. The only thing I need now is the suppressor, which doesn't even work. I've got the flashlight for it. I don't like how that zombie is just sitting there in front of the store. I do not like that. What's this? Yes. Yes. Oh my god. There we go. Oh, let's try that shit out. See what it looks. Oh, look at that. Look at that Moe's in there. So sexy. Oh, no way. Shit, where'd it go? Oh, look at that. I never had one of these before. Is this a shotgun? No, no, no. It's the, uh... Two shotgun, whatever it is. Oh, I never had one of these. That's so cool. I still have never seen a shotgun yet. Never seen a double barrel. A lot of people say it's shit. So, uh... Yeah, I'd rather just keep the Mosin. I really do not want to be walking around with this. Especially since it has no ammo. It's such a cool gun. My first time ever actually seeing this. Wow, that is cool. Anyways, Dean Hall was talking about uh, future updates in DayZ, and one of them, which really excites me, is the uh, burying, burying, what's it, Barry? barrier, yeah, barriers, what the fuck am I talking about, and uh, so you can bury, barricade, what the fuck, <laughs> you can barricade up uh, windows and stuff in the future, sorry again going in the water and so yeah you can make a pretty cool you know little house or something that's what I plan on doing making my own base pick you up again why can't you just drag it into your hands I don't know it's such a 
cool gun. Such a beautiful game, even on a shit PC. I really do need to get a new one, though. But, uh, speaking of some Daisy news, there's a barn up here. Apparently, Dean Hall, or Rocket, is stepping down as the leader, or like the lead developer, of DayZ. And, uh, that's really misfortunate. But he will not be leaving until the end of the year. So, hopefully he changes his mind. Because, you know, he's the one who created the mod, and, and uh, created the standalone, obviously. And let's just hope that uh, Bohemia Interactive doesn't fuck up the game any more than it already is. Uh, Dean knows what he's doing, and I'm pretty sure they do too, but I just feel like they're going to change the game completely. And it's not even going to feel like Daisy anymore. But, uh, I don't know. Bohemia Interactive, they're a great company, great people, make great games, so I have, I have uh, trust in them. Doors open. I heard footsteps. Shit, hurry up, I got a damn losing. Pistol, pistol. Just walk. And, uh... Whoa, lag. Hello? Anybody here? Shh. Don't know why I said shh. Just hear footsteps. Saw a guy. Nope, is that a house right there? Is that Star Silver? I'm gonna move, so I gotta be careful. I think this guy's a bandit. So I'm running up to the big ass barn. Whatever that is. Shouldn't be able to get a shot of me. Look at these trees here. Sneak around and flank him. Pretty sure he's on top there. Gotta be really careful. Server restarted, and uh, so I rejoined about 20 minutes later, and he's not here. Oh, like, but I just found out where I'm at. Holy shit! There you go. Hello. <laughs> Bitch. Let's get got him. Find out where I'm at. Northwest airfield. It's just up that hill. I'm not trying to go that way. I'm trying to head back to the coast. Or at least find some... Oh my. That was average FPS. Drops. But uh, I'm trying to find a nice place to live. Nice place to survive the zombie apocalypse. Back here. I could set this up as my base, but I just feel like it's too, you know, insecure. It's got a little fence around it, like that. I definitely need to set the base, though. Now, uh, every time you find, like, uh, sticks or something, Make sure to keep them because you can actually make a splint out of sticks and a bandage. That was pretty neat. 
I'm just looking around for some supplies here. Not entirely safe. Looks like somebody's already been through the rift. There's nothing here. Yeah, looks like everything's been taken. So yeah, if you, uh, oh, there's some food. I don't need food, but I'll take it. So, if you do find sticks, then you can combine them with rags or a bandage to make a splint. That's pretty cool. But, uh, better go find my base now. Now that place right there looks like the perfect place to survive the zombie apocalypse. Look at that house. Nowhere near a city. Got birds flying around. It's beautiful here. Got this open field, so, uh, anyone that comes up this way, get sniped. Sorry, but, uh, it's just how it goes in DC, I guess. Otherwise, they just kill me, so. And if I am under attack, I can actually just run through the back of those woods right there. That would be really nice if there's a pond or something around here, or a fountain. Check it out. Doesn't look like there's a pond or anything. I haven't really checked that much. I could just not wait for this uh, boarding up window shit. That is gonna be crazy. Got some extra pants just in case I, uh, you know, shit myself in the zombie apocalypse. The door doesn't open. It's a little misfortunate. Bedroom? Not much. Oh, I got a book to read. You know, I should read the books. No. That's stupid. Why would they even put them in then? It's a jungle book. A book collection. I start my own library. Turns out that house is actually not the best spot. I would rather have a house with a second floor. I can snipe out of it. So we're gonna we're off to find a better house. Oh my. There's Green Mountain. So now I'm heading the right way. Still haven't found a good place yet. Supposedly there's a military base up here. Let me go check it out. I don't actually see anything. See a town, that's all. Yeah, I think it's just up here. Gotta be really careful. I think it's it. I think that's a prison right there, and I think that's a barracks. Yeah, there it is. I don't think we'll run into anyone. I gotta trust my gut with this one. The gate's closed, so that's always a good sign. You might be wondering, you know, why don't I just set up a base here? Because this would just be awesome. It's a compound. You know, I have military loot shit. But the thing is, people could come here, log out, and then, you know, I'm just sitting in my base relaxing. Next thing you know, they log in right in front of me or something. And they kill me. That's really why you don't want to, you know, make a base in a military area or a civil area. It's a nice little place to chillax. Alright, I hope, I really, really hope I find a long range scope. That'd be so awesome. Ooh, an SKS. Take that in my hands. Hopefully, I can find some ammo for it. Found nothing good at the barracks. It's just back there. A tree leaf. And there's a tree line over there. But, uh,. Still haven't found the base, and hopefully we can find one soon. Oh. That's weird. That's a really weird bug. Okay, do not swim in water. Just warning you guys. That was weird. And of course, as soon as I go to record it, it goes back on. Why the fuck did that happen?
That was really weird. I was just swimming through this little thing right here, and all my gear, my backpack and my Mosin, it just went off of me, and they were floating on the water. That's so weird. Oh shit, found some sticks. I need to make room. Fuck the jungle book. Sorry. We don't need uh, that. Oh fuck, I had SKS ammo the whole time. Should have checked. Don't need shotgun ammo. We don't need that. Don't need that. Yeah, should be enough space. Alright, so now I'm going to show you guys how to craft a splint. You can use any bandage. Just gonna drag that over that. Craft splint. And voila. Okay, so now we actually got something to uh, rely on because we break a leg. Put that back in there. Wait, where'd it go? But that was pretty cool. More sticks. I'll take it. Just in case. Whoa! Here it is. Here's my base. Sun's going down. I'm gonna call it a night. Set up. And chill. Well, I really wish this, <laughs> this lantern worked, but apparently not. Did I actually took away your matches. I don't think so. I don't think you need matches to light it. But anyways, guys. Found a base. It's epic. And it's only going to get more epic as soon as they fix this damn light. Anyways, make sure to like and favorite. And I'll see you all in the next video. Thanks for watching. As always, have an awesome day.